Get ready. It's another episode of Hemkey at Home. And the letters all have songs. Hey guys, Coach Rachel here. I had a great question this week from Amelia and her dad about what you should do with your hands once you've brought them together in your pitch. You have options for how you can sort of create momentum with your arms to get yourself started into your motion. So I'm going to go through a few of the basic uh, kind of swings and motions with your arms. So you can decide if you're a, a slightly newer pitcher, what feels best for you. Ultimately, you should choose what feels good rather than having someone tell you you can only do one or the other. All right, so the first one that I'm going to feature <clears throat> is the one arm swing back. And this is the one that you will have seen me do in a lot of my videos. Remember that no matter what you are doing, the rule is you have to bring your hands together at some point, it's called presenting the ball. You find your grip, and then this is the part that we're focusing on today. I do a one arm swing back where I sort of sit back in my chair and I swing back one arm. From the side, it looks like this. That's one option. Another option you have, which I'm not, I don't feel very comfortable doing, so it might look a little bit silly or not very natural, but kind of the forward punch. So you bring your hands together and you forward punch into your motion. I'll do that a little bit slower and a little farther back. Bring it together, forward punch. So you're almost creating kind of a little momentum by kind of sucking your hands in and shooting them out. The last option is the two-arm swing back. Oh, perfect, a bird making lots of noise right there. Two-arm swing back. Both arms come back and then you are launching yourself forward. Both arms back, forward. Those are the three that I'm gonna feature. There are other variations off that. I know we've got a few people in our program who do like some little sideways action, which I think is totally fine. If you are going to add any motion to any of those three options I featured, make sure that those motions are small. Uh, I do not encourage doing something like huge arm swinging or huge side swinging because all of that takes extra energy. And when you are pitching two or three games in a tournament in a 90 degree day, all of that energy is going to wear you down over time. So please do something that's a little easier for your body. This week for Swing for the Fences, you can do any of the videos, uh, any of the drills from the videos that I've uh, shown you previously. The step stool drill, which shout out to Vienna, you killed that one. Uh, runner's lunge, that was another one that I featured. You can do a runner's lunge or you can shoot me a video or some photo evidence of you taking care of your arm, icing, stretching, massaging, all of that good stuff. I'll see you soon. Yeah.